Hello, my dear friends and dear students. As we have discussed uh, many things before uh, writing the program in Python, and uh, again before writing the program, I wanted to tell you that we uh, ev every program requires a translator, which translates your high-level language code into machine code or native machine code means and then computer or you can say the cpu works on the code which is in machine code so in python we use interpreter so inter what what does interpreter do interpreter translates the code of python one by one or line by line and uh, executes it and as soon as any error is encountered within the program it stops the further execution of the program is stopped and where is another translator like compiler what does compiler do compiler translates the whole program in the machine language and if any any error is encountered during the compilation or the translation after translation it comes with number of errors in the program so user has to rectify the problem and correct the error and after correcting the error recompile the program and then get the output but over here it is not there in in the case of interpreter it is not there so i am i am going to take the first uh, statement in python that is print statement this is a very simple statement uh, like print a very generic meaning of print like you, if you want to print anything on this screen then use print statement so the same way the meaning of print is to print uh, anything on this screen so print requires two parameters one is and one is and and second parameter is sep so what does it do print basically prints whatever is given along with print statement on the screen and these two parameters and and sep are the optional parameters it depends on the user whether he or she wants to use the parameters in the program or not so here uh, the function of print is to print whatever you give to the computer on the screen so i am going to take you to python ideally to show the function of the print statement so this is the python interface ideally interface and this is the prompt python prompt from here you can write python statement so if you want to write anything like print hello world print hello world so this statement this print statement uh, enables you to print the output on the screen so as soon as i press enter this way hello world is printed as output as i have told you that uh, it uses the parameters also so parameters are sep and n so what happened see uh, uh, the function of and parameter so how to use and parameter for example if i say print my name Okay, this time I am going to create a file where you can write the program. So over here, this is untitled file. And from here, you have the option to change the interface or configure ideally. So options and configure ideally. Over here, you see a lot of options by which you can change the interface of 
Python. And suppose uh, if you want to change the size of the character, you can change it. Say so this is 20 and you can change it to say 22. So the character will look bigger. And if you want to uh, print the character in bold data, you can check mark this box or check box. So the character will be printed in bold. And after configuration, you can say apply and OK. And now you are able to or you are ready to write the code. So if you if you want to write, I'm going to use uh, the parameters like and and set. So I am writing a comment. This hashtag is used to comment in Python. So I am uh, writing here. I am going to use and and set parameter along with print function okay so now I'm going to write print and uh, you must note that every function or the command in python should be written in lowercase letter until until or unless you are told to write in capital you will have to write the function in a small case letters so print so you see here this is the syntax print value over here you see sep sep means separator and means and the line file and system dot standard out flush false and whatever so these are the parameters we can use along with the print statement so i am just going to uh, tell you the function of sap and and so this time i am using and so my name Over here, I am using and parameter and this time, I am just giving any character you can give. So, I am giving a space here. So, what happens in this case, as soon as and statement or and parameter is encountered in the program, so the subsequent line, subsequent line means the next line of this program, print. Krishna. So see here, I have written my name is then ends, I am ending it with the space single character and in the next line, I have written Krishna. So what happens in this case, when this is, uh, program is executed, just because of end space, the subsequent line or the next line the output of the next line will appear in the same line means my name is Krishna will be printed in the same line okay but before uh, running this program you must save it or otherwise it will ask to save it with some name so I'm just I'm just going to run the program run the model f5 either you uh, press f5 or use the menu run module so as soon as you click on run module, it asks for source must be saved before execution. So you have to give a name, a generic name which you can recognize. So I see F1. This is my first program. So I write FP1. So over here you observe that my name was in the first line my name is was in the first line and this space is just because of the end parameter and that is why the output 
which you see here my name is Krishna both the statements the result of both these statements is printed in single line only now next part is I'm going to use SAP here SAP SAP means separator for example Krishna Agra and I want to give a character separator this separator is just hashtag and before hashtag I'm enclosing one in space and after hashtag I'm enclosing a space okay so in this statement there are two strings Krishna and Agra and one is uh, the upper statement is having my name is and is ending with the space and the next line output will be printed in the same line so when I execute this run so you see my name is Krishna in the same line my name is Krishna and separator is between Krishna and Agra. So this is the meaning of end and set parameters. So and uh, moreover these parameters are optional. So you may use or you may not. Now moving to the next part. So see here, very simple print statement. The first statement says print calculations. So when you execute this program, it will print calculations on this screen. And over here, print 2. 2 is the literal, integer literal. So it will be printed as it is. So 2 is printed. Then plus, plus is the character. So character or this thing should be enclosed within the single course or double course. So after 2 plus sign as a string or the character will be printed, then 5 is printed, then equal sign is also in single course, so equal sign is printed and after that 2 plus 5 this expression is given 2 and 5 will be added, so it will give you 2 plus 5. Similarly, if we have 3 integers like 4, 3, 43 and 10 and separated by into sign so what happens in this case it is like 40 into 3 into 10 and in the next line because just because of n so i am going to show you this also calculations I am not taking and here simply going to say 2 comma plus comma 5 comma equal comma expression 2 plus 5 and this so this will give you this output means 7 so let's try it, run, so calculation 2 plus 5 is equal to 7, let's 
take another example and this print 40 comma 3 comma 10 comma separator is say into comma and print forty into three into ten and when I execute this then let's see what save it and run it so we'll see okay uh, for uh, 40 in I just have to do one thing because I wanted to insert equal sign here so I'm I have to give here equal and again execute it and this time the result will be different so over here if you see 2 plus 5 is equal to 7 40 into 3 into 10 using sap and end this is the output we are having so this way print statement and sap operator uh, sap and end parameters work hope you got it so again let's see what is next so over here uh, this is again one example this example we would like to see print and this time I am going to give sep is equal to a When you run this, you will get this example or this result. So, see here 2 plus 5 is equal to 7, 40 into 3 into 10 is equal to 1200. And, madam, and over here, if you uh, look at the parameters, here I have used SEP, means these digits should be separated by into sign. And the result should be printed in the same line. That is why we have used AND parameter. In this print function, I have used A separator. And actually, I was having only three characters. M, D, M. And I wanted to insert capital A between the characters. So... I have used use sap so that it should separate means uh, the program or the interpreter should separate these characters by a so I have used uh, sap a so this is the output and if you uh, cross this the program will be like this M D M B we had three characters and I wanted to insert a between these two characters, between these two characters, so I have used SAP here. So when you run this program, A is inserted between M and D and between D and M. Let's move ahead. Okay, so this time, again, this is the same program. 
suppose a is equal to 50 and b is equal to say 2 and when you say print a comma b comma sep is equal to slash comma and is equal to equal and in the next line if I say print a upon b let's see what happens run the program now the result would be like this so hope you understood so uh, i have used uh, sap and and parameters optimally so wherever you want to use uh, sap and and parameters you can use easily hope this is clear too clear to you and what is next so on the next slide it's a simple code and uh, what I want to uh, clarify here that if you want to insert apostrophe or quotes in this string then you will have to use either double course or single course depending on the choice of the statement and suppose i want to use evolved in medieval so uh, when when i print german castle german castles will be printed and when i say evolved in double quote medieval now this time the string is in single course but I wanted to insert double code before medieval and that is why the entire string is enclosed with the single course and wherever you uh, wherever I wanted uh, double code to be inserted I have taken double code before just before the medieval so this this was the output we wanted so if you execute this the output of this would be like this similarly I want to uh, print or I want to insert the codes after the ages or the string. So I have taken this ages and a quote in the single course only. So in the single course, I have taken ages and after ages, I have put double quote. So when I execute this statement, the output will be ages like this. And similarly, if I want to print apostrophe s, yes, like the statement is Ludwig's fantasy, it means Ludwig's apostrophe in Ludwig apostrophe then s. So the entire string should be enclosed in double quotes and apostrophe s yes, should be inside the string. So Ludwig's fantasy will be printed like this. So I think there is no uh, hassle at all. Uh, how to use print how to use sap parameter how to use a uh, uh, and parameter and how to insert double code or how to print the double code or single code in the output using the print statement through this example we are able to do it so this is the print statement and the parameters hope you understood and if you understood so kindly share it with your friends and if you have not subscribed my channel yet kindly subscribe it so that you get the notification of the video as and when it is uploaded for that also you will have to press bell icon so we meet in the next video till then bye bye